patients from all walks of life who come here. Um, homeless patients come here, students. We have um, some children that come here, and we have a lot of patients that are retired that have extra time. But what's really awesome is that they get to do, go through the whole dental hygiene process of care from start to finish without any um, substitutions of any kind, and so we're really excited about that. In this clinic, this is a first year clinic, we each have four students. So these are my four right here. We have a supervising dentist you met, Dr. Corp, and then Ms. Minters here, Ms. McLaren here, and Ms. Osageta on the other side. The clinic is great. Not only is it great for us to get into a bunch of different mouths, we see a ton of stuff here. And everyone's different, so working with different patients help you basically build your skills. See, for instance, this cusp is kind of yellow, yes. right on the tip here. You'll find the same thing on this uh, other tooth, these tooth develop. This is my second career, so I uh, had my own practice for about uh, 35 years, and uh, I retired about three years ago, and this opportunity showed up, and I thought it would be a good way to kind of interact with the students again and maybe pass on a little bit uh, something that I learned in my 35 years. I find it to be heavy so that when you're kind of up and moving in a direction that it... This profession is very, very technical and very precise about what we do, and it takes time to learn it. And for our students, they are with us for two full years. And I think that's really important for the students because they know it's a continuum in a professional program. And then we have a separate deal. Okay. We're providing a service here of training the future of dentistry. Not only will our students be able to perhaps just treat patients in a private dental office, but out in communities, helping patients have greater access to care. And a lot of times uh, we have projects that they tell us to pick a patient who we can use throughout the semester. So he is going to be my special case patient. And uh, we talked about flossing, which um, now that, you know, we're alive, I'm thinking it might stick a little better with him. We'll see. I'll let you guys know how it goes. <laughs> I like working with these young people. They're full of uh, vim and vigor, you know, and they're kind of exciting to work with them. This is my fourth year here. I'm proud to be an instructor here, and it's just really exciting to watch the light bulbs go on. They're really putting the whole thing together. I'm just really, really proud of this class.